Planet Dolan. From boats that can float on water to a die stack that defies gravity, we count 40 weird pictures that will trick your brain. Number 40. Here's a photo of a tropical parrot in a tree, but wait, look a little closer and you'll see it's actually a strategically posed woman in colourful body paint. Former world champion body painter Johanna Stoda is behind this impressive optical illusion which took four weeks of painstaking planning. Number 39. The force is strong here, or should that be horse? How about both? In this photo, a young recreational horse rider appears to be living every preteen boy's dream, wielding a lightsaber. He's also dropping his jaw and looking off camera as if he's just seen his first pair of boobs, so it looks like it's a good day for the young Jedi. Number 38. In this perfectly timed backyard snap, we see that someone successfully trained their golden retriever to breathe fire. We always knew you could do it, lassie. Number 37. Put your hands in the air like you just don't care. Yep, all four of them. This guy's clearly on the team because he plays amazing defense. Number 36. This landscape photo is not quite as obvious, but with a bit of lateral thinking, you can see that these islands make up a sideways violin. The main island makes up the violin's body, the water is the neck, and the two trees on the right resemble tuning pegs. This amazing trickery is caused by symmetry in the water's reflective surface. Number 35. This image, titled Momentarily Headless, features gymnast Catherine Coronel of Venezuela performing her routine at a rhythmic gymnastics competition in Colombia. Her supporters say she has a good head for gymnastics. Number 34. Sometimes when you gotta go, you gotta go. Doesn't matter if you're surrounded by a hundred strangers or are seated two meters away from an elderly woman. This should coin the expression, to pee like an oscillating sprinkler. Number 33. This photo is known as the hovering boat optical illusion and requires a very particular set of conditions to work. It's taken somewhere in the crystal clear waters of the Caribbean and as you see, the boat appears to be hovering in midair rather than floating on water. Pretty cool. Number 32. This piece of brain trickery is what you get when you cross a rocky island, a sprinkle of black magic and a photographer with an insane eye for detail. It's a horse, of course. Number 31. This image of a triangular die stack looks impossibly put together. In fact, the longer you focus on it, the more your brain screams in protest, begging to know the secret before it leaks out your ears. Those responsible insist the image isn't photoshopped, which begs the question, what David Blaine voodoo is this? Number 30. Right, so here we have a group of smiling ladies on what appears to be a ferry, and hang on, what's that in the background? Why is that small jockey riding the woman on the left? It takes a close inspection but the small looking man is actually in the background of the photo and the black line that looks like his leg is actually just a pattern in the woman's shirt. This is just a perfect moment of accidental hilarity, proof that the giant octopus controlling the universe from space has a sense of humour. Number 29. If you needed any further proof that cows are a holy animal, check out this divine creature and its impressive butt flame. Clearly this cow stumbled across the trademark for flamethrower, or maybe it learned from Lassie in the earlier photo. Very amusing. Number 28. This sunbathing woman must have a splitting headache. I wonder if this guy axed her nicely if he could take this photo. Whoa, 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 whoa. Put down, put down the axe. I promise I'll cool it with the bad puns. Number 27. Here's a smattering of pictures featuring accidental dongs. Looking at these will no doubt make you feel self-conscious next time you take a photo. Be aware of where all your limbs are. Number 26. Because it's fun to test our depth perception, here's a photo of a man-sized seagull and a seagull-sized man. Imagine how insatiable his appetite for chips is. Number 25. This photo is proof of why you should never invite Sub-Zero to play ice hockey. He never plays fairly. Number 24. In this happy post-wedding snap, we see a man and centaur walking off blissfully into the sunset. So beautiful. Number 23. This little guy's burning up the soccer field with a gender-bending ponytail hairstyle. Even if he loses the game, he wins at life. Number 22. As if giraffes weren't strange enough, this picture was taken at just the right moment to give the illusion of two heads. Some creatures are just too beautiful for this world. And, uh, some aren't. Number 21. In this photo, it's virtually impossible to distinguish whose legs the guy on the left is holding. Is it the leggy blonde or the leggy brunette? Number 20. This is an award-winning photo of what appears to be a man straying dangerously close to a cliff edge. He's actually just walking along a riverbank inside the canyon and the photographer's just playing with perspective. Number 19. Here we see what looks like two players engaging in hand to rectal surgery during an intense, no doubt low scoring, soccer match. That's a brown cardable offence boys, Australians will know this technique as the John Hopawate. Number 18. Attention all train commuters, beware the dreaded dog faced woman. This creature of legend can be seen riding the rails after midnight and she doesn't buy a ticket. Number 17. Nothing beats sitting on a bench, stretching out your strangely long, strangely feminine legs on a cloudy day. Right, fellas? 
Number 16. This majestic looking creature is the fabled offspring of a deer and a Staffordshire Bull Terrier. Or is it just a dog standing in front of a tree? A magician never reveals his secrets. Number 15. In this pic, a tower obscured by fog looks like a ghost ship sailing through the sky. Pretty terrifying, especially for anyone who's seen The Mist. Number 14. Here we see a uniformed guard murdering some serious looking banker woman with a rapier. If that's not what's going on here, then I have no idea. Take that, shitty interest rates. Number 13. These pictures play on the male mind's tendency to find boobs in every situation. Whether it's instinctual hypersensitivity or wishful thinking, these photos show that some will find eroticism in things as benign as trees and elbows. In 2015, a high-end Argentinian lingerie brand called Jane Payne ran an ad campaign featuring elbows, knees and armpits cleverly disguised as cleavage. The tagline on a lacy bra clad elbow reads, if it can make your elbow look sexy, imagine what it can do in the right place. These poor horn dogs. Ad companies are toying with their emotions. Number 12. These creeptastic photos of trees, rocks, and sand formations demonstrate the way our brains naturally perceive familiar shapes and faces in objects. The region of our brains responsible for this is called the fusiform face area. Number 11. This cleverly orchestrated photo was captured at the Sela de Uyuni salt flats in Bolivia. Photos like this are taken here all the time because, as you can see, there's very little on the horizon to draw depth cues from this famous dry lake bed. Number 10. More trickery from nature. Here we see some of what looks like a gateway to heaven. It's actually a rare cloud formation called a fall streak that is combined with perfect sunlight blocking cloud cover. In another image, a setting sun at Yosemite National Park makes melted snow look like lava flowing over a cliff edge. Finally, for giggles, here's a photo of flowers that look like bushes. Number 9. Introducing the sequel to Dogface Woman, Dogfaced Man. Dogface Man is a highly competent action hero who can skydive, ride speeding jet skis over ramps, and roll over on command. This is his Tinder profile picture. Number 8. Do you ever feel like the world is a topsy-turvy place and that you're walking to the beat of your own drum? These guys do. I love how people in the background are looking on like it's a possible crime scene. Clearly not Inception fans. Number 7. Mirrors have been trolling us since they were invented. Check out this gender-bending, bartending, bowtie-trending individual. He's on cocktail duty because he makes them with extra sass. Number 6. This is Billy, whose hobbies include exaggerated waving and reaching for things that are very high up. No, if you look closely, you'll see Billy's long arm is actually an illusion caused by another kid doing something suspect under the table. Mystery solved. Number 5. The trick of this illusion may be obvious, but in the future we'll probably all have bionic arms like this. Hopefully there's a model that comes without the tacky tattoos. Number 4. This is either water ballet, a weird twist on the butterfly stroke, or a highly insulting whale impersonation. Either way, it's not good. Number 3. In this image, the woman on the right appears naked thanks to the left arm of the rotund woman in the foreground. It's kind of awkward for both of them. I highly doubt they would have framed this treasured memory. Number 2. When we look at this pack of zebras, our eyes often force us to do a double take. This is because their stripy pattern disrupts our ability to follow the object's continuity or detect edges. Because of this, it can sometimes seem like zebras have two heads or multiple bodies. Number 1. Is it a young woman with her head turned or an old woman with her eyes downcast? You may have to press pause to get your head around this one. Thank goodness it's easier to distinguish age in real life or the dating world would be a truly uncomfortable place. That's it for this countdown. And have a good one! Did you enjoy the video? That's fantastic! Did you know we still have a gaming channel? Collaborative! It's for playing it all and come look at us as we play some video games! Like animation? Have some questions about life and the universe you need answered? Come check out Super Planet Dolan. Danger Dolan and I will answer your life questions. Links are down below.